I wanted to look at the real oddity of, of our everyday lives and how we miss each other uh, and, and fail each other and then sometimes don't fail each other. One of the stories in the collection is about this young girl who falls in love with a visiting circus performer who's an adult man and she, she sees him for a day and she loves him. And that was actually, I, I was working on um, a Friends Theatre Festival in, that was traveling from town to town and there was this performer there and there was this young girl who was very taken with him. And nothing else in the story, the rest of it is made up, but I was walking around thinking about her and thinking about what I saw in her of that, um, just that sudden interest in this man and how moving she was or how moving I found her and then thinking oh that could be a short story it can't be anything else because it's so it's so tiny the the thing that she's feeling now it's so intangible plays are driven by conflict uh, they're driven by conflict and they're driven by action and a story can have it has more meditation to it and so I felt like I needed I wanted to, as a writer, make a bit more space for that meditation. To write a lot and to treat it very prosaically, uh, to treat it almost like a job, if that's possible. I know it's, it's often not possible to treat it like a job, but set yourself a quota, sit down, do it, and you'll slowly, slowly get better. And, uh, and write about what you can't, write about the things that you can't shake like the things that you're absolutely obsessed with, and then that might translate into something that would engage someone else.